Hey everybody, it's Annette with The Art of Intuition, and today we're going to talk about the faultiness of the future. So we've been talking for a while about the vertical, vibrational aspects of time. How the past doesn't matter, how the future doesn't matter, how we are right in this present moment. This is where we are, this is where we, where we create from. There is no future, there is no past. It is just this moment. So, for when we get into our linear mind and we start thinking about the past, how do we get stuck? What is the true faultiness of the future? One, salvation. I'll be happy when I get that person. I'll be happy when I get that job. I'll be happy when I have more money. I'll be happy when I have let I'm thinner. I'll be happy when I'm this, 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 and this. There's a thousand different things I could sit here and talk about that would make everyone else happier. And I do it too. <laughs> when that certain thing happens. When you look at anything like that, and you even have that mindset, you project it out to something really far away. It doesn't even really exist anymore in this timeline. It's like it's, it's somewhere else. The next thing we can do, we treat everything we do as a stepping stone. It's a means to an end. You're not really in the moment of what you're doing, you're just doing it to get to somewhere else. Humongous faultiness of the future. Everything is not a stepping stone. There's no salvation coming. There's no, com we don't need to project anything out anymore. Everything is in the moment. Your vibration in which you create and in that moment depicts the next moment. And the vibration you're creating at is where that future is gonna occur. So if your perfect mate is in a vibration up here and you're in a vibration down here, you have a lot of vibrational work to do to get to where that can manifest. So is it in a future? Is it in a far off time? In some way of thinking it might be, but, but it's really not. It's your vibration of that moment. Where are you creating it from? Are you creating it from your head because you feel like you have to get all this stuff done to get somewhere? Or are you creating it from your heart? Because you really want to create something. Looking at a future time and setting goals. Let me, let me say that another way. There's nothing wrong with setting goals. And working toward something. But if you really put your energy and heart into what you're doing in every moment, you enjoy the journey. You're kind of honoring each step along the way. You're not waiting for something to happen. You're making steps for it to happen. You are empowering yourself to get to that next vibration. Okay, everyone. Don't get caught in the faultiness of the future. Remember, it's just an illusion. Your vibration in this present moment depicts your next moment. I wish everyone the most amazing moments and keep practicing the art of intuition.